I welcome back loyal subjects of Funk and in the last session we managed to build well just right now I managed to build a carrier so we're going to need some aeroplanes I thought that's what a bastion might have been but we're waiting to find out what it actually was so let's build ourselves a raider and I wonder if we can build ourselves a Oh, a battle suit. One titanium needed, a centurion. Let's get a centurion. We need a few more aeroplanes, I'll tell you that for now. Before we uh, start invading Russia. Because, as I have put in the victories... What's that there? Conquer all other players' capitals. Why has it got a little sun sign? How dare you. If he declares war on Hotama. Oh yes, go on Hotama. Not only he lost Pembella last session, not only did he get take it back, he took Sabda as well. And there's no way these lock can take Sabda back. It's just in a poorly geographical area. Excellent news for the Commonwealth nations. Let's get you up here, big man. 45 that bad boy choose some uh, pre-duction it's recommending us to get a repair facility we'll get the thorium reactor always a good option I would say so we've got another ra we've got a raider getting built there a raider getting built there and a destroyer here so that's nine turns minimum before we can launch an attack on Sviatoi. So it might even be this session we can take one of Russia's cities. And we do have the best. Let's get one of these. We do have the best uh, equipment available in this the best uh, units. I don't think the enemy's got level 3 uh, troops yet. He's still got artillery, whereas we've got um, we've got punishers and they really will deal some punishment. That is for sure. We'll take that one, take that one, we'll take that one and we will gift it to Australia with any luck. There we go. Seven more turns until. Well, actually, it'll take about ten before we're in position. We want to take this in two turns as well. Then, once we took that, this one's cut off. And we can send an army that way. And the whole idea of this whole war is to try and divert Russia's, Russia's uh, attention away from winning. Uh, using, trying to achieve their victory conditions. Oh, they've raised it. <laughs> How dare you. Plus also, I really wanted to put a city exactly where they've put this one. It really annoyed me planted it there, except for Axe, it should be ours. Of course it should. So I think what we'll do is we'll purchase one more Centurion, because I don't think we'll need any more than one Centurion, I would think anyway. We'll see. Ah, oh, expedition's been completed. That's a quest update, so we've got a decision. Absolutely. Oh, and another virtue. Get that one. Which allows us what the hell? Oh, we get another virtue. Oh, what, you got that one? Right, <laughs> okay. I thought we might have. Um, trade routes gain plus 6 energy per station to you. That one. I'm still lootly. What, what happens when we finish this? Plus 10% production each. 
uh, in each uh, city. And we can move on to this final tier. And every academy academy improvement. I'm just gonna go for that. I'm gonna go for the last tier. So I've never filled the last tier and I think it would be very nice to do so. Notice that you've been hunting for salvage and artifacts near artillery territory. We meant no offence. Oh, is this Brazil? Your requests mean nothing! <laughs> I thought it was Hatama for a second. I would have been pleased if it was. I'm not pleased, uh, upset. And I would have said sorry. That's right, sod off. Oh, what the hell? They've both just like got in touch with me, told them they're pissed off, and both of them declared war on each other. <laughs> Which is great because that means we, they will not get involved if we, quite wrongly, declare war on Russia. So there we go, fellow subjects. We're getting very close to this war now. The aliens detected. Like that. Oh shit. Have that. Take that, alien. <coughs> oh, pardon. I don't burp as much these days because I haven't drunk uh, any Guinness while playing for quite some time. But that will return one day. Especially when I do the uh, Baldur's Gate 2 Let's Play, which will happen eventually. It's been a while, I admit. But Baldur's Gate will make a return. This may Thank you. Oh, that's right, we have stolen some science. Steal more science. And I want them to steal more science simply because I think it would slow his science What's down. Ours is yours. For that's a price. Right. Well done, fellas. I'm glad the war's going well. Right, so what we'll do is, because we're getting close now to the production of everything we need, I will purchase two units to help us in the battle. Um, yes. I will get one raider, not raider, sorry, I've got a raider being completed. Right now, let's rebase that raider in Beagle. And we'll see if its range is far enough to. Um, that's another raider, please. And I will purchase a centurion this turn. End the turns! What's ours is yours. Accept. For a price. Take as much float stone as you want, big man. Might even buy another raider and beagle. But we'll just see first if it's got it's in range of this city. we'll check the points again. We should now firmly be in front of uh, India because Hutam has taken out one of their cities. We are firmly in front of India and Brazil and catching up. Almost uh, one in front of Panasia. Right, so first of all get the Centurion over here. Second of all, let's see. Um, air intercept, air oh, we can, we can reach it. That's fantastic news. So we'll just build more troops, like a centurion. I think would be fine, and we'll purchase with our money one more raider, and in turn, and we'll have another destroyer. We'll bring that up into place. And then right at the start of the following turn, if we are <sighs> sod off France. 
Oh yes, they're going to get destroyed. The losing cities to Brazil. We could help them. We could help Brazil and take a couple of their cities easy. Oh no, they're not losing cities. That is a Brazilian city because it's under martial law. Bollocks. So we might have something coming in the future with uh, France. Fortify that radar. Just a couple of more turns now, fellas. Build more military units. Because if our initial attack fails or we are weakened, we're going to have to revert back to old plans. Oh dear. Oh, sod your France. I suppose we've always had an old rivalry. Britain and France. Well, we usually know the outcome of most of those wars. So I'm not very scared, to be honest. Ooh. We're going to have to bombard this sea creature once and for all. Providing it doesn't... Yeah, it's moved over there. Brilliant. It's not exactly what I wanted. Oh yes, we are now very much in range. It's going to be at least three turns though before we uh, manage to land or do the first stages of the attack. Because, ah right, yes, we're going to have to move him as well. I know he's going to get hurt in Miasma, but it's just what happens, isn't it? Sadly. It'll be fine. He'll only take one set of miasma damage. What are you doing? Right. The attack is almost ready. A gene garden, please. Uh, let's reassign to a French city. Just to piss them off. And to not upset our friends. Right, so. Oh, he's healed. Oh, because that's right, because they heal automatically per turn, don't they? Right, which, which means the attack is now ready. We are now going to war with uh, Russia. And with any look. Oh, he's doubled the defence in that city. Sodding hell. Sodding hell. It's not what we wanted. Ah. Means nothing though. It's a very small amount of uh, defense, really, in comparison to the troops that we're using. <laughs> Bugger off. Oh, shit. What is that? Oh, it's a worker. Oh my god. Look how much damage we're doing. Oh. We can't hit. We'll just uh, leave him there for now. And we will get the raiders out. Guy. We're too strong. We'll have captured it next turn without the help of half of our stuff. And then it'll just be a case of setting up defensive capabilities and moving on this one. Let's see what Russia can do then. All we have to do now is walk in, literally. <laughs> Incredible. Ah, France is making enemies again. Yeah, we're not over. Oh, not good news. Yeah, 
this. It's because their aeroplanes were crap. So they've done bugger all and we get to heal as well. Let's have a quick look at the... Uh, thank you very much. Do you know what I might do? Yeah, I might actually do most of the damage with the aeroplanes. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Give us an airstrike. Easy on. What's he keep doing it for? Oh, there we go. So that's how it should have been done first time. And then we waltz in and annex the city. Of course, we annex the city. And then do you know what we do? We rebase. Of course we funking rebase. That went very smoothly, fellas. And we still have a positive health. So let's establish a network in France. And then turn. <coughs> Got a nice bit of uh, money building up now so we could buy defensive capabilities for Svatoy. We can leave these two EX to out of range of uh, this city and can target any infantry units about. <laughs> Intruder alert. Intruder's been in identified. Our people have drawn up plans for the. Alright, connection established. Intruder alert, he's gone. Um, let's keep the raider there, keep the centurion there as well. We'll do some rebasing. Do some more rebasing. Ha, <laughs> I've got a free worker. It's probably wise to purchase a troop in Rupert's Land as well. In fact, we'll just use this uh, Centurion. Purchase another Centurion. Do it like that. Oh, two available upgrades. <laughs> oh, battle suit. And we will go for. Plus 30% when attacking. Fairly simple no brain though, isn't it? Oh, dragoons. Very strong. And we'll get this. And in theory we should now be able to purchase the Exodus gate. But what we'll do is we will see if we can get one in Georgetown right after we build this uh, raider. Oh no. That's not good. What time is getting there? Oh well. We'll do something about it. A rebase mod. Beagle. Much safer there. Um. Hmm. We'll just fortify these guys for now. Oh, haha. <laughs> Have this. Do an all 
auto plant will destroy that and and then we shall select Georgetown see if we can choose to build the Exodus gate oh no wait on no wait on must be built probably by here let's build an institute probably by a worker should we have a quick look in the uh Exodus. It requires level 13. We got that. Right, we'll need a worker then. So the question is, where's a nice worker? Where's the Exodus gate? Storm, Terrascape, Generator. It's not there. Let's put it back in automatic. Have a look one more time in Georgetown. Exodus Gate, 39 turns. Right, we'll do that. What the hell? Venga. Well, 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 oh, I should have given them money actually, because they're fighting the French, aren't they? Oh, shit, the conquering city is like mad. Conquering cities like mad. Thank you. What is a raider? Fortify the centurion, get the raider. And rebase. Nowhere because it can't rebase. Let's uh, attack with their strike then nowhere because it's not within range, but it's a good defensive building. There we go, you see. Surrounding them nicely. Might even now we won't be able to squeeze this one in in this session, but we will in time, the next session definitely be conquering that city as well. I mean if we let's have a look here. Siphon that energy if you don't mind. I mean if we have a Uganda on Oh shit. Let's have a look. We've got a lot of work to do here, we've got a lot of people to stop. In fact, we'll bring that one there. There's Miasma there as well. Right, we'll fortify that. And I think we'll leave everything where it is for now. So, thanks for watching, guys. And I will catch you later. Oh, after this quest decision, obviously. Yes. And goodbye. <laughs>